Yo, what's good guys? VT here, and today we're back with another video. And before I start the video, I want to say Merry Christmas. Uh, it's going to be a great Christmas today, especially with the Lakers and the Clippers going head-to-head -head tonight. LeBron James, Kawhi Leonard, Kenny Davis, and Paul George. So, who do you guys got winning? I got the Lakers winning. Uh, I mean, the Clippers, I think they have a little bit of the edge right now because LeBron and Anthony Davis are dealing with some injuries, but still got them winning. So, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be training Kyle Kuzma, not just him, but Kyle Pope. And also, Lakers fan, would you guys trade Kyle Kuzma now? Like, if you guys would, well, if you guys would, who would you guys trade him for? So, first of all, I'm going to be trading Contavious Cabo Pope, maybe for like a JJ Reddick. Let's see. So, we got JJ Reddick here for Cabo Pope and Quinn Cook. I mean, any more trades that is. Nah, it's. Yeah. I'm going to be doing this here right here Cabo Pope for JJ Reddick. Uh, I'm also going to be trading Kyle Kuzma. And probably a first round pick. Oh, wait, no. We can't even offer that. Yeah, Kyle Kuzma. What can we get for Kuzma? All right, I'll tell you anyone good. I'm, a, I'm looking for a realistic trade. Maybe, like, I've heard Robert Covington. I've also heard of Derek White. Could, like, this trade right here, Derek White. Robert Covington. Well, not, not Robert Covington, but Derek White and Rudy Gay. I think that might be the trade right there. Yeah, uh, the Derek White's been part of the rumors about him and Kuzma being swapped. I mean, they both have the same contract, basically, around the same age. I, th I thought Kuzma was, like, 22 years old, but he's actually 24, so he's still young, but not as young as Lonzo and Brandon Ingram. So I'm going to do this right here. I know we get rid of Danny Green, but keep in mind, this is the guy that always always declines in this game so like right after this season he's probably gonna be a 74 overall danny green i don't know why but 2k hitting on danny green i guess so here's our starting lineup i think i'm probably gonna put Derek white because the reason why they would trade for Derek white is to have like a a player off the bench that could definitely create his own shots i don't know why they don't want jj reddick to start but he's definitely gonna start. So let's uh fix these minutes real quick. Javel McGee starting over Dwight Howard. I mean I'll prefer Dwight, but keep in mind Dwight Howard is 34 years old, so it's really smart that the Lakers aren't starting Dwight Howard right now. Oh we got okay, Derek White, Avery Bradley, Dwight Howard, and Rudy Gate. And then let's give minutes JJ Reddick. We won't give him too much because he's 35 years old. Like those people that are on their mid 30s 34 35 like they could literally get any injury like lebron james i hate to say it but he could literally get any injury like like kobe like you remember when kobe got injured that torn achilles happened out of nowhere so i don't i hate saying it but like could happen to him and i hope it doesn't happen so we gotta we're gonna get both of them 29 uh, we'll give him 29 minutes. Man, we got we gotta get Derek White playing a lot for bench. He's probably gonna be a six man. Rudy Gay, six eight, and small four. He actually goes up by a lot. Where is Rudy? Where's Rudy? Yeah, he's gonna play that small four. Cause uh, that increases overall. And then. Or we can probably put him at the power forward, power forward, and run Avery Bradley and small forward. Avery Bradley goes up, even though he's six foot three. I don't know if he's six foot three. I think he's six foot four, but I'm gonna put, I'm gonna keep it the same. I'm gonna keep it the same. I don't wanna mess anything up. So we got, I'm gonna put everything on no preference. Like our year, our goal is to win the championship, cause. We we are we arguably have a better team than us than when we had Kyle Kuzma. So we're gonna go with probably a uh, seven second. It looks like 
seven seconds probably everyone does good at that seven seconds Frank Vogel he's a great coach I mean he's doing good right now uh yeah so there's gonna be rotations I mean should I play him at the small forward or, or power forward should I play him at power forward nah I'll leave him at small forward he says for eight he could play that he's 33 years old so he's like he's getting up there in age so yeah before I sim let's check out the power ranking yeah, we're definitely behind the Bucks. NBA.com has the number two. 2K Sports at three. Eric has the number two. So I'm gonna simulate to the beginning of the regular season, and I don't care if we make the finals. I don't care. We gotta win the championship. Like making the finals will not make me happy. We gotta win the championship. So we we made it to the end of the season. Uh, we actually had a great record, 65. Hopefully, 65 and 17. We had a great record. Uh, we might be the best record in the league. Uh, we had a 16-game winning streak. Like when I sim to the end of the season, we had a 16-game winning streak. Uh, we were 24 and six, and then we were 40 and six, and then guess who ended our winning streak? The the Clippers. <laughs> we lost to them by three points. So yeah, they ruined everything. The Clippers. Okay, so first time we got the Spurs. 41 and 41. Okay, let's check out the player stats. Anthony Davis, 29 points, 12 rebounds, 2 blocks. Yep, there you go. LeBron James, 27 points, about 11 assists. 53% from the field goal, really efficient. 39% from 3. Could be, could be his career high. Yeah, it's actually his 08 oh, He actually shot. Yeah, 12 13 Miami Heat. LeBron was a beast. Yeah. It's that time he was a beast. That was when he got his ring. He, he was hungry for that championship. Uh, JJ Redick about 14 points from three. I must say 45%. That's what LeBron James need. JJ Redick. So Roger Rondo, uh, 8.6 points, about nine points. Uh, eight assists. Uh, 40% from three. His career high. I'm pretty sure. Yep. His career high. Uh, Roger Rondo actually has a jump shot. Rondo. Actually making more threes than ever. Derek Wright, 8 points. Uh, 4 assists. Not bad. Uh, uh, nice score off our bench. That That's the reason why the Lakers would go for JJ. I mean, not, not for JJ. I mean, definitely for JJ, but for Derek White, for Kuzma. But first time we got the Spurs, I think Kuzma. Kuzma and the San Antonio Spurs were actually having a tough time. Don't okay, okay. I was gonna say we're not we're not losing to these team. Oh actually wait wait, wait. I'm a, I wanna tell you Kyle Kuzma. How did Kuzma do? I almost forget. How did Kuzma do on the Spurs? I'm not I'm not saying that Kuzma is trash, I'm just saying he's not a perfect fit with the Lakers. Like it's not his fault that everyone expected him to be that third all star behind LeBron and David. It's not his fault. It's definitely not his fault. Doesn't mean he's trash. That means he just doesn't fit with the Lakers that good. Maybe he needs another chance. Second round, we easily beat the Thunder Gentlemen Sweep. Guess who we have in the conference finals? The other LA team. And then here we have the Bucks and the Sixers, Lakers and the Clippers. Yep, that's going to literally be the conference finals this year. Who's going to win it all? And the Clippers always beat the Lakers like... Oh, actually, a good series. Oh, no. This is a game. Oh, okay. I was going to sit with SimCast, but we beat them by 21 points. Yep. No one ever beats Game 7 LeBron games. Game 7 LeBron is unstoppable. Okay. Look. Game 7 here. Game 7 there. That's literally realistic. I, I literally got Game 7 in the East and Game 7 in the West. Like, really realistic. Finals. Who's going to win it all? Oh, don't tell me the Sixers are going to beat us. Come on, don't tell me Ben Simmons, he don't got a jump shot. Come on. We got to beat the Sixers. We're not losing to this team. Okay, we went by two points. There is no way we're losing to the Sixers, especially in real life. Ben Simmons got no jump shot. And Bede needs to stay healthy. I'm not hating on the Sixers. Okay, we won by one point. All right, we won by one point. We tied the series. We came back. That's important. Now, can we force? 
2K, really? All right, so we lose to the Sixers. Can we force a game seven? Like, damn. You think you think the Sixers are gonna beat the Lakers? Hell no. Okay, we lost to the Sixers. We lost to Ben Simmons, who does not have a jump shot. I don't even. I don't think they're gonna make the finals. I think the Buffs are gonna make it. The Buffs are gonna make it over the Sixers. I'm not hitting on them, but it's facts. They can't beat the Lakers. All right, let's get him. Oh, let me turn on trades real quick. Okay, so NBA draft. We literally gave all of our pick to New, to New Orleans. So we don't care yet. We had a first round pick. It doesn't matter at all. So we almost won the championship. We lost to the freaking Sixers. Oh, no. Yeah, that's all 2K is sometimes. Unrealistic. So we have our point guard. Our shooting guard. We're, shooting guard is good. Small four is definitely good. Power four, we gotta get Anthony Davis. I forgot Anthony Davis a free agent. We gotta get AD back. Centers, center, center, centers. Uh, Dwight Howard, how did he do? Nine point seven rebounds. We gotta get a center though. It's on my side. Twenty three million dollars. Nope. No one is giving you that much. Uh, Serge Ibaka, how did he do? One point four blocks. I'll get him. And then we gotta get Anthony. Yeah, Anthony Davis. That, that's your money player option. Come sign with us. Unless we don't sign on these players right here. Demarcus Cousin. We're not gonna get him back. Troy Daniels. Troy Daniels. He's a bad shooter on the Lakers right now. That's what he said. So like, I think the Lakers should give him more minutes over Caldwell Pope. Definitely. So we couldn't get Serge Ibaka, which is an L. So Sanders, yeah. I mean, who we got left? Mason Plumley. Who else? So we need a center. Uh, Anthony Davis is not going to be our center. Like, he doesn't like playing the center position. So, uh, glass cleaner. I need, like, Marcus Saul. How did he do? He's a good defender. Yeah, we need Marcus Saul. Let's get Marcus Saul. Let's see. Yep, we got Marcus off for point guard. We're good. I mean, Shabazz Napier. Why not? Shabazz Napier. Uh, who else? Yeah, a back of center. Like, a back of center. I'll get Ekepe Odo. I don't, I don't know if I said his name right. And then I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. So I'm gonna simulate the beginning of the regular season and I'll be showing you the uh, lineup, rotations, and all of that stuff. So here's gonna be our rosters right here. Here's everybody's overall. Derek White, I think, went up quite a, uh, he went up overall. I wanna see what I can find a trade for uh, Talon, Talon Horton. And then, where is he? Shabazz Nate. Oh, we can't even trade Shabazz, okay. So maybe him and then a first round pick. All these rules. I always forget to take them out. They're so annoying. Let's see if we can get maybe like a backup center, a decent one. That'll back up uh, Marcus Saw. You know what? Let me, let, let me take those rules though. They're just so annoying. The rookie, all of these stuff. Let's take them off. All right, that'll make it way much better. Okay, Shabazz Napier, uh, Talon Horton, and then a first round pick right there. How, what, what would that get us? That first round pick is valuable. LeBron ain't getting younger, so valuable. Okay, so let me see. Yeah, not the best trade offers. Like, I don't know who, who should I trade. Uh, what can I get for Marcus Saw? Mar Marcus Saw give me Talon Horton, and then a first round pick. What would that get me? Maybe, may give me something good. I'm looking a better. Okay, the, those are those are all the offers. We're probably gonna keep Marcus Saw. Yeah, this is really tough. We're gonna, probably gonna keep Marcus Saw. Like. 
I don't, damn, I live crew, so I don't want to trade crew, so. You know, I, I just want to see some offers for Caruso. Like, I know, I know where he's a go, but like, yeah, I'm not going to trade him. I just want to see any, like, offers, any good offers. I will do that offer, but we're not trading Caruso. He is definitely staying with the Lakers. I don't know. Talon Horton, I will give you Avery Bradley. Like, we need a somebody. We, we need someone. Maybe like a backup center. Kev Kevon Looney. Luke Kennard. Luke Kennard. Luke Kennard. Nah, the Pistons will never do that. But Kevon Looney. And we get Amari Spellman. And let's see now. So now we have J.J. Redick, Derek Way, LeBron. Uh, Marcus Hall, uh, Rudy Gay. Kevon Looney, Amari Spellman. Then Shabazz Napier. As a backup point guard. I'm not sure if I like Chabad Napier as a backup. Maybe put Caruso. But you know what? I'm going to put Caruso. Caruso is going to be a backup point guard. Okay. You, the reason why I did that. Because I almost ended up trading him. Like not almost. But I, should, I look for trades for him. Which I should have never done. So I'm going to put him as a backup point guard. So he won't do anything to me. Okay, so power ranking. I, we definitely have a little bit of a worse team, but all of them have us at number one. This is our year. We got to win the championship. I don't care. I don't really care. Making the finals will not make me, like, happy. It'll, we got to win the championship. It doesn't matter if we go through a game seven in the playoff. We got to win the championship. So we made it all the way to the end of the season. We actually... Pretty much disappointed, 47 and 35. So we did pretty bad. Uh, I believe we're still a playoff team. So All NBA first team, LeBron made it. All NBA second, Anthony Davis. All NBA third. Is there a Kyle? No, there's no Kyle Kuzma. Uh, the Spurs didn't make it either. So we are actually the third seed. So how did Kyle Kuzma do on the Spurs? Yeah, he. I don't know, 2K doesn't like Kyle Kuzma. So, wait, wait, wait. Let me, let me show you guys a player stats for us too. For the, for the Lakers. So, LeBron James 27 and nine, Anthony Davis 22 and 11 and two blocks. Here's the rest of the team. So first round we got the Jazz. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't think we're gonna, yeah, we're actually gonna beat them, but let's see if we can make the finals. Give me Nuggets. We got Memphis. Okay. Second round, we got the Grizzlies. And it looks like they're good. The second seed. Probably John Moran taking the next step. So, 4-2. 4-3. Yep. You can never beat a game 7 LeBron. DeMar on the Grizzlies. Okay. That, Carmelo Anthony or Cole Anthony? Carmelo. Okay. Carmelo on the Grizzlies. He got the, Carmelo carried them to the second seed. <laughs> so three one four one. Let's get that four one. Come on four two four. Okay four two. We got the Hawks. We won by two points. Okay big W. We got the Hawks. Can we win it all? Can we? We got MVP Trey Young. Can we win it all? Uh, I'm gonna be quiet. Okay we won game seven. You can never beat game seven LeBron James. Thirty six point game seven LeBron James. Never beat him. You can never beat Game 7 LeBron games. Okay. We finally won the championship. This shows that records don't matter at all. What matter is the playoffs. Doesn't matter if you're the AC. You still have that little chance of winning the championship. It matters how, how you do in the playoffs. So if you made it all the way to the end of the video, please like this video if you want to see Kyle Kuzma getting traded. Especially Lakers fan. I'm, I mean, as a Lakers fan, if I could get... Like Derek White, like a decent player or player better than Kuzma, say Laurie Markkinen, then I'll definitely do it. But subscribe if you're new. Merry Christmas, have a happy Christmas, and I'm out.